tell you how I come through with the one two, kicking shit like kung fu. Treat a bad bitch cause she average. I'm a savage, no hoe. What you want, do? What's good, guys? It's been a minute, man. It's been a minute since y'all seen me do a squad builder. I'm sorry for the people that subscribe for my FIFA content. Uh, just trying to find, you know, the right avenue for my channel. So, but nevertheless, we are back. And uh, last weekend we did play weekend league. I didn't stream um, just because I had to study and I didn't want to, you know, I was really just playing during my study break. So I'm going to show you all the team I had. I won 18 games uh, and I had six games left that I didn't play so we really could have got elite um, on the road we were on but let me show you guys the team we were rocking out with you know just to see if you guys want to make something like this and uh, we did have a star player in here and I'll tell you guys why I didn't and why or maybe why I do enjoy playing with him so just stick around and see who who that is so we gonna get right into it man we got Larice right here. Before, actually, before we get right into it, man, um, if you're new, hit that subscribe button, man. I do a lot of FIFA. I stream uh, weekend league, a lot of tips. I'll leave my uh, FIFA playlist at the end of the video, so stick around to see that. And uh, yeah, like the video if you enjoy it, man. So without any more, <sighs> without further to do, let's get into this. So we got Larice, man. Don't need to say much about him. Tall goalkeepers, way to go. At least above six foot. And we're going to keep it moving, man. So this has been like uh, something that I've been having on my teams for a while. Just because these are untradeables. Uh, so we throw in um, TT right there. And we throw in Jordi Alba, all right? First owner. First owner. They're both untradeable. Uh, I played 124 games with MTT and uh, 102. Now, let me show you guys my record to show that's you know that's a good amount of games right there. So we got Jordi Alba, MTT, Larice so far. All right, and we're gonna I guess we're gonna keep going on this side right here. Uh, who did I have? This is really on the spot. So let's see. Let's go back to that. Dang, I'm tripping. Uh, let's go, Any. Dang, I went the long way. Alright, so, if you guys want to see why I have this guy as a striker, stick around to the next video, man. Hit that post notification bell, man. Um... And you'll see why, because I'm going to upload another squad builder of what I'm rocking with now. So, you guys don't want to miss that. It's, it's the best team you've ever seen on YouTube, man. Alright, so we got Kondogbia right there, alright. And we're going to switch to this side right here. And this side, we, we went with a little something different, man. Uh, so, we had... Did we have Kimpimpe? I think we did, bro. I think we did. Trying to make sure we had the inform Lala. Everybody's using him, man. Look at these stats, bro. 86 pace, 80 defense, 80 physical, 81 passing, 83 dribbling. Like, ha, huh, he's a tank. All right. Let's see. Uh, stamina's great. Aggression. There's a reason why everybody's using this guy, all right? There's a reason, all right? So, we went right here. We got the boy. I'm tripping. That's nobody's name. We got the boy Rabiot. Alright. So we get these three links right here. Reguchi. Now we're going to save this spot. We're going to save this one. Because this was a star player. I went crazy. I dropped basically all my coins for this man. So right here. This is what we had right here. We had... The boy Sane, y'all know I packed him for people that are uh, returning to my channel. He is untradeable, alright? This guy, let's look at his, his buy. 194 games, 86 goals, but most of the time I've been using him as a super sub, so can't really down him on his uh, goals per game ratio. And then we threw in the boy... 
Ah, uh, what is his name? There we go. Jesus. And most of these players you guys probably already know about, man. And, uh, got the boy right here. Mares. We need, we need those green links, so you already know what I'm going for. With an 85 rated. Pretty good, bro. 5 star skill, 4 star weak foot. Uh, he did, he was a little slow. He was a little slow, alright? I'm not gonna lie to you. And, uh, Let's see. Here's the guy. Here's the guy, man. K. D. B. Alright. We bought the big boy, Kevin DeBriner, guys. And, um, I got a lot to say about him. I want you guys to peep the stats. Peep how good he is, man. The stamina, the... Dribbling, passing, shooting, pace, eh, eh. Now, y'all are asking, probably, why are these guys, you know, concept players? More of the story is, I sold them. I sold them, man. I had to get rid of them. I'm going to throw up some clips right here of uh, KDB, bro. And, uh, uh... I have a lot of negatives about this card, guys. He's, um, 90 stamina. Uh, he was getting a little bit tired. Like, I had to sub him out around the 75th minute almost every game. He was very slow on the ball. I felt like he had concrete in his cleats. Um, great passer. Great passer. But, uh, he missed. He hit the crossbar a lot. He wasn't finishing. Now, there are some clips that you're going to see right here on the screen where he is, you know, scoring shots. But I feel like he has to score those. You know what I mean? Like, any other card in that position is going to score those. He did have some crazy long shots. A couple. Maybe, like, two. But nothing, like, that's going to, you know, 400k worth. Now, let's see how much he's going for now. Yeah, like... You could get so somebody so much better than that, you know what I mean? So, I was like, bro, this is not working out for me. So, what I ended up doing was, uh, hold on, let me, let me make sure I'm not missing anything else. Oh, yeah, he's very slow. Penalties were actually the only time, like, I saw him scoring, scoring. Because, you know, he's just, even though the 79 is finishing, I, I was like, it's KDB. I'm not taking it with anyone else. Composure. Uh, he was hitting the crossbar a lot, so I really can't, you know, allocate for the 88. Agility and balance, you will notice that, guys. He is so slow. And there's a clip I have that I'm going to throw in here where you guys can just see. I'm trying to feed him. Like, I'm force-feeding him the ball. Let me make sure I'm still recording. I'm force-feeding him the ball, and it's just... I'm trying to get that finesse in and his skill moves. Even though he has four-star, it just seems slow. It seems like you're doing freaking skills with Kondogbia when you have him, you know what I mean? It just He's just not worth it, so what I ended up doing was, I switched it like that, I kicked him out the squad, and I threw in Aguero. We could have been doing so much better because I was, while well, I had KDB, I did go on a win streak at the end, but that's because I was using more of, you know, Sané and uh, Mares a little bit more. So I moved Jesus down to center mid, and I got Aguero, and I got some bad things to say about Aguero too. I don't know if it's just me, because there might be people watching this video and be like, man, you're you're an idiot. Aguero's great, but he's he's short. He's He gets bullied off the ball very easily. Um, stamina is a big factor because he was, he was dead. It felt like he was trying to run way too much, man. Like, I was like, relax, bro. You know, it's... I have you on uh, freaking stay forward, and he's running back a little bit, trying to play defense, and uh, he scored more than KDB, though. I can say that. He obviously is faster. His agility, balance, and reactions are great. It was just the stamina, and I felt like I could get someone way better for 200K, you know what I mean, rather than... Um, spending that much because i think he was like 270 ish k yeah he's, he's gone up a little bit um 
but yeah guys other than that we did great like i said i had 18 wins with six games left so potentially 24 uh could have got elite three right there but yeah uh what else do i have to say lala amazing if you have the coins go out and get this guy man he's great uh Kempimpe, i wish i had enough money for uh lucas hernandez but you guys will see that if y'all stick around and watch my next video and if this is you know a while down i'll go ahead and put my next video at the end of this video so you can watch that uh, but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this man if this is a team you think you could get down with these manchester city guys right here they're great and if you know how to play with them it's just my opinion about them I'm not saying he's you know completely trash but i just feel like it's it's rubbish guy <laughs> it's a rubbish bro his card is not i don't think it's worth 400k and if it was 200k then you know i could put him like in a 41212 let me show you guys the formation i was running with it uh let's see which way is it four two three one i was running the wide one and i had you know this is where kdb was playing he was playing at the cam position i had him like that but when I started winning the games is when I put it like this. Um, I started putting Sonny up at top. And I put Aguero right here. And Jesus at the uh, left camp. And I just started winning more like that. But um, I also have some custom tactics for y'all in my next video. So you really want to stick around and hit that bell, guys. To watch my next one. And... Uh, let me know what you guys think about this. Is this a team that you feel like you could rock out with? Obviously, I don't have any problems with these three right here because I've been using them on almost all of my freaking squad builders. Loris, I, I'm starting to like him. Uh, I use Chesney a lot, uh, 86 inform Chesney. And Chesney is great, but I don't see any you know sign of weakness from Loris. So let me know if you guys enjoyed that man if you're new to my channel like i said earlier hit that subscribe man you you're gonna want to stick around and watch all of my other fifa videos um hope you guys are having a good one thanks for the 200 subs man and i'm out